Right, so today we're checking out this Ibanez Tallman TMB30 bass. This is a short scale bass guitar. Um, these retail for around £135 for the black and they do a sort of a mint green and a red colour and they sort of vary between 140 and 165 so uh, BAX um, I've currently got these for £135 at the minute so nice cheap guitar um, so down to the specs this has got a poplar wood body with a nice weight to it nice thickness to it as well uh, it's finishing a glossy black so it's got a three ply pick guard it's got the PJ set up these are called dynamics uh, pickups so it's got the P bass on the front position and on the back it's got a jazz bass so you get a variation of sounds it's got a nice sturdy uh, bridge piece there really good quality high mass so it resonates well um, it's got two volume controls one for each pickup so the front one's the P bass the middle one's the jazz bass pickup and then it's just got a master uh, tone control input jack on the front a really nice looking guitar uh, onto the neck it's got a bolt on neck maple neck with a Jatoba fingerboard um, yeah it's, it looks a little bit like the Po Ferro it feels pretty pretty good it feels like a rosewood to be honest um, in terms of specs I didn't really see a lot what the radius is I'll probably say it's probably uh, about 12 radius um, medium jumbo frets it's a 30 inch scale so that's short scale 30 inches from the nut to the saddles there it's got a color coded headstock which looks pretty sweet with open tuners so I'm going to be playing to a backing track today um, I'm not a bass player, so go easy on me, and I will be using a plectrum. <laughs> but um, yeah, so I'll be going for the three different positions. So the P bass pickup, then I'll play both pickups together, and then just that jazz bass on its own. So let's plug it in, see what it sounds like.
Okay, so there you go. That was the Ibanez Tallman TMB30, finished in black. Brand new, you can pick these up in a minute for £135. They come in two other colours, the green and the red, which are a little bit more expensive. And um, yeah, it's a nice looking guitar. So let me know what you think of it in the comments below. But yeah, for the price, you get a nice variation in sounds with the P bass and the jazz bass pickup. Obviously, volume for each pickup and then a master tone control. Got that high density bridge, which is a nice addition on a budget guitar. Bolt and neck. Maple with a Jatoba or Yatoba fingerboard. Um, really does feel nice actually. It's got a nice seed profile shape to the neck. Nice bit of chunk to it, but not too big. Matching headstock with them open tuners. Um, build wise, quality control. Yeah, paint works really good. There's no marks in it. I've still got the original pit guard plastic on it, so it will shine up a bit more. Um, the frets are really good, there's no sharp frets. Yeah, nice guitar for the money. So, yeah, let me know what you think to it in the comments below. Again, I'm not a bass player, so go easy. But let me know if you like the the P bass, both together, or the jazz, pay, jazz bass pickup on its own. And uh, yeah, that'll probably cover it for today. So, if you enjoyed the video, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. You can follow me on uh, social media, on Instagram and Facebook, The Guitar Manifesto. And, uh, yeah, please comment. I enjoy reading all the comments and um, I'll see you all soon. So, peace out.